Hello, my name is Angela Brown and I am the Personnel Records Supervisor in the Human Resources Department. Today we are going to go over the process for Department of Children and Families requests. I'll show you how on the computer. We will begin by going to the Pinellas County Schools homepage at www.pcsb.org. Next, go to the Employment drop-down menu and select the Personnel Records option. Now select the DCF Access Florida Loss of Income Request page from the left-hand panel. Department of Children and Families DCF requests are processed through the work number. At the bottom of this page, you will see the Notice to Employees referring DCF to the work number downloadable file. This file contains the 866 DCF call center phone number along with contact information for the work number which you may wish to provide to your DCF's caseworker through your Access Florida account in person or by asking the DCF call center representative to make note of this information in your Access Florida account. Going back to the DCF Access Florida Loss of Income page, you will see the section that talks about additional documents in which DCF leadership has asked that PCS employees provide to their caseworkers. These documents include your pay stubs for the past four weeks, your salary information page, the staff calendar highlighting your last day of work for the school year, as well as highlighting your projected first day of work for the upcoming school year, and the payroll calendar highlighting your last paycheck for the school year. These documents can be uploaded to your Access Florida account, or you can print and bring them to the DCF office to have them and ask them to give them to your caseworker. For instructions on how to access the above reference documents, please select the Proof of Employment and Income Document link or go to the Proof of Employment and Income Documents page from the left-hand panel. Please note, if you are scheduled to return to work for the upcoming school year, you are considered to be an active employee whether or not you are scheduled to work during the summer. This applies to nine, 10, 10.5, 11, 11.5, and 12-month employees, as well as substitute and contract employees. For additional information regarding this process, please visit the Pinellas County Schools website at www.pcsb.org, go to the Employment drop-down menu, select Personnel Records, and then select the DCF Access Florida Loss of Income request page. Thank you.